water signs pisces cancer and scorpio welcome to my channel my name is chelsea thank you so much for liking and subscribing i really appreciate your love and support in this reading we are going to find out how does your person in mind feel about you right now and this is a love reading so your person in mind has to be involved romantically with you in some way shape or form spirits and angels please show me for water signs pisces cancer and scorpio that person in mind how do you feel about water signs right now Ten of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Okay. Hmm. You could be dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Chris. Your person could be also a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. There's a lot of court cards here. Fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpio. Okay. <clears throat> Can be any sign. I feel like either your person in mind. Okay, I'm going to start with. If this is someone you're separated from, okay? And then and then we're going to go to, for those of you con currently connected with a new person, okay? So old person, new person. We're going to start with the old person first. If both of you are currently separated with the king of swords here, they could be feeling like they need to strategize something here because there's something that they're not too happy about with the temperance here in reverse. They're feeling like either this is not fair, this is not balanced, um, all that, <clears throat> they may be acting very cold, acting as if they are unfazed, but deep down with the temperance in reverse, they may be feeling kind of unstable, emotionally unstable in some way, shape, or form, okay? And with the Three of Pentacles here, they also feel like, it's funny how, okay, uh, what I'm getting here, water signs, if you're separated from this person, it's not just about, they feel like things have Things are getting real. Things have got to get real. Actions uh, need to be taken. As in, because the Three of Pentacles feels a bit like, you know, because it's something realistic, something Three of Pentacles, something physical. So it's not just about the, just the, just about the emotions here with the temperance and lovers. It feels like, that both of you will have to come together and agree to something important um, in order for reconciliation to happen or to try and make peace. For some of you, it is just, if it's separated from this person, it's almost like as long as we can work together um, s civilly, like being civil to each other, I'm, I'm good. Especially for those of you, if your person in separation right now, <clears throat> if both of you have a business together or share some properties together, share some assets together or children, okay? If not, if you were not married to this person, have no children, not sharing anything at all, I do sense them feeling like they, they would like to mend things with you, okay? But right now, they, they can't. Right now, with the temperance here in my verse it's like they're not in the right place in the right mind to do so but the intention is to mend things with you or it could also be because of some external factors maybe because of money <clears throat> travels um with the especially if this is long distance <clears throat> sorry about my voice here the cherry in my verse like they can't quite move forward or take actions as of yet right now okay maybe their focus is on something else to build something else to fix something else it could be money related career related or fixing fixing themselves okay with the not up ones here in my verse yeah it feels like they don't want to or that they can't take actions towards you right now because they need to prioritize something else with the king of pentacles here okay and with the Knight of Cups in my verse and the Wheel of Fortune in my verse, they feel stuck. 
and it could be stuck because of myriad of reasons okay again it could be due to some other responsibilities location issues money or emotional issues it could be that because the knight of cups here is in love first they do feel a little sad but but they're not trying to be productive or that they're trying to look for like a proper solution so they may be feeling like both of you need like a real proper solution okay in order for both of you to be either on the same page or reconcile get back together or at least be civil to each other because the ten of pentacles is right here um they feel like maybe there are other things in the f because the ten of pentacles gonna get bigger pictures a bigger picture so they may be feeling like they need to see the bigger picture even though both of you are separated they need to see the bigger bigger picture um that's leading towards the future that may have something to do with either money family children or if both of you share some assets together share money share same bank account all right so what are signs we're gonna find out next if you are if there's someone relatively new okay if this is someone new with the king of swords here it's a it's a very cal calculative king right this they, they feel like okay i'm not gonna it feels like they're like i'm not going to either put all eggs in basket or expect way too much from you from this connection yet because I need to wait and see. I need to collect information with the King of Swords here. King of Swords, you know, sword is up. So it can be a little bit guarded. And the chariot here is in reverse. And the Ace of Pentacles here is in reverse. So they may be feeling that... Yeah, I don't know if this is going to be successful. If there's someone new. I don't know if I want to commit yet. Or that they could be feeling like... Maybe you don't really want to commit yet. Again, it could go vice versa. And the temperance here is in love first. Maybe because there's some disharmony between the two of you, even though this is new. Maybe there have been some arguments or some other factors, okay? External or internal factors that could make them feel a bit like, I don't know how this is going to go, right? With the king of pentacles here. Your person could be a Virgo Capricorn or a Taurus. I do sense that their intention is to be serious. Their intention is to be committed or want a commitment from you. And the King Knight of Wands here in reverse, their intention is to put behind their past or their past behavior. If they were inconsistent, if they were somebody, somebody who is very reluctant or very jaded, um are very doubtful in regards of committing to someone um uh, committing to someone or being in a committed relationship in general i do sense maybe because of the will fortune here well first maybe something about their past that may have made this person feel like it's gonna take a lot before i'm gonna commit right but i do see a potential here with the three of pentacles they may feel that if this is someone new, they may feel like maybe this this let's maybe this could work, right? Let's see if both of us can work as a team. Not a cups and lovers. They're very careful of their heart. They don't really want to. They want to be very practical when it comes to this connection. I see them not wanting to fall in love that easily, that quickly, because of the will of fortune lovers. They don't want to feel like if if they were to catch feelings for you or to fall in love with you then to them it's like oh my god now i'm stuck because of my feelings so they are very careful that's what i'm seeing here and with the ten of pentacles here they feel like yeah there could be a potential for the both of you to build something together um yeah two of cups is right here they feel like both of you um have the potential to fall in love with each other or be on the same page and the four of pentacles here also them feeling like maybe they should hold on to this connection but they don't really again four of pentacles is like you know closing one's heart chakra here holding the the pentacle close to the heart so it feels a bit like them feeling like yeah i'm gonna be very protective of my heart 
but I do see a potential again. Two of Cups and a Ten of Pentacles here. They feel like both of you could actually be with each other. Could actually, you know, um, build a life together. Have a future together. But there's an energy of like, I don't want to jinx it, right? <laughs> they feel like they don't want to jinx this. So they're being very, very careful. With the page of wands here can indicate maybe this person is a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, or a Leo. They are passionate about you. They're willing to explore possibilities with you. Um, they definitely are interested and can see a future with you. Okay, uh, water signs, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, this is your reading. Hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. I'm going to leave you with two playlists on the screen right now. First one is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. Check it out if you want to. The second playlist is from this channel. It has all of the readings that I've done for you and for the rest of the signs with different topics, different questions. But these readings are still new and because I post them almost every single day and they're still relevant. Okay. Hope to see you back here again tomorrow. Take care, water signs. Bye.